So I thought I'd make a video on the CMAP reveal. It's a new chip that came out and it is amazing. So let me show you what it actually does. So as a little preview, you can see that there's no contour lines. Well, once you take off the contour lines, you can actually see what's underneath the water for like ridges and drop offs. You can actually see them. So let me show you what it actually does here. So this is your regular CMAPS Plus, okay? What should be already loaded on your unit if it's newer on the HDS. This is the HDS Live that I have right here. Okay, and, and I'm showing you Lake Belton. It's in Texas, Central Texas here. And it's one of my hometown lakes here. So let me zoom in right here. And you, as you can see, you can start to see the contour lines, right? Okay. You see the depths, the contour lines, okay? You can see my, my trail right there while I was running. Okay. Um, but yeah, you can see the contour lines from the C-Maps Plus. You can see these are the colors that I chose to go with for the contour lines and in the depths. And that's what I did with the C-Maps Plus, okay? Now with that chip that I, that I just showed you, the, the C-Map Reveal, Okay, so you're gonna go in the menu, you're gonna hit more options. Okay, you're gonna go your map source, which CMAPS Plus was already on here, all right? This is the new map chip, the reveal, okay? So you just wanna select that, go back, okay? And then go under chart options, scroll down, and right there where you see shaded relief, go ahead and hit that and watch what it does. Okay. It looks exactly the same, but you need to go down here to your shading. Okay. From your color palette that you made, just like I did, and turn it off. And it lights up like a Christmas tree. There you go. This, oops, try to get that out of the way there. So what it does, see here's the land. You can see how there's ridges there. So there, there's like a drop off just on land that you can see right there. So, and right here you can see the contour lines overlapping that area. So you can actually take those contour lines off also. So you just go back, go to more options, chart options, and see here. Yep, chart options, sorry about that. And shading back. No contours, there it goes. Sorry, I was confused right there for a second. All right, so, took your contour lines off. Now you're able to see your drop off ledges, your, your actual contours of what's underneath the water. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. That is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Let's let's look at that cove right there. Right here is the dam right there at Belton Lake. Okay, let's zoom in a little bit. And you can see all that flooded timber. That's how it just drops off right there. And you can see, like, if, if you're trying to pinpoint, you know, where these fish are in these drop-offs during, let's say, mid midsummer, you know, you know, Say like right there. 
you can you can actually locate these fish on these actual drop-offs set you a waypoint up here and you're literally fishing on top of them oh well, you can come out you know come out here or something like that spot lock with your trolling motor and you could literally these be fishing that drop off right there because you see that drop off from the the maps reveal the c map reveal you know it, it's amazing what this thing can do so if you haven't got one yet uh definitely pick one up because this this is you know i haven't fished with it yet but i i've been playing around with it for about an hour now and this looks absolutely amazing i can't wait to get out in the water and, and you know use this because i mean man what what you can see under the water now just by taking the contour lines off and then if you want them back on all you gotta do is just go back to your menu and, and put them on more options chart options right there go back take no contours off and what it did is it put the contour lines back on over the shaded relief look at that amazing so uh let me know what you guys think of it since i just showed you uh what it actually does and what it you could do with it um let me know if you've had it for a while and, and what you've done with it so love to hear your comments all right see you guys later bye